insert a USB and and watch this video follow this step up to up to 5 minutes watch this video up to 5 minutes and follow these steps then close the video open my computer and you can see the USB has named EFI and the total size is 196 um, do not for format this pen drive um, later and just follow my video to format it otherwise you can break your USB drive ok for now just right click and manage and go to disk management Here you can see the Mac uh, install bootable is 6.36 GB and the EFI is 200 MB. You are just seeing here is a uh, EFI. Uh, the Mac main boot partition is hidden in Windows, and you should have a uh, EFI system partition and primary partition. Now restart your PC. Uh, you need to back up important files because installing Mac will remove all the files on the hard drive. So make sure you back up everything you need. Let's start. You need some configuration to make changes. So press F2 when the dead logo appears. And in BIOS, first restore the settings. Click on BIOS levels. Okay. So in the boot sequence, the BIOS is setting that reboot is needed. So I am rebooting it. Again, when the dead log appears. You can see that the, the boot the boot settings is in UEFI and uh, let's add one new boot option name it USB click on browse with the file system FS2 and go to EFI EFI boot and boot 64 EFI and make this US USB boot to top after that click on FI Now don't press any key. Now you will see the clover menu here. Go to options, otherwise you won't be able to boot into Macintosh. So go to options and PCI devices and check USB ownership, USB injection and inject plug ID. Return and go to graphics injection, graphic injector, and 
make sure inject edid and inject intel eject and it is the fake fake id hello 002 one two three four five six seven eight otherwise you will get uh, system uptime in nanosecond and continuous rebooting so this will bypass that error now OS X from installer it enter the language and go next click continue accept the license agree with terms go to utilities Dixie utility and click your hard drive and click erase and click this erase you can name it anything i am doing cancel because i have already installed it after this you will be successfully installed macintosh on your laptop you need to plug the usb after installation and and this time and after installation you need to choose boot mac OX from here what you have given the hard disk name click enter and you will be able to boot before that you have to check options again like uh, graphics ingest injector as 134.578 as fake id and you also have to check uh, USB ownership, USB injection, and inject clock ID. And boot Mac OS Syria. Welcome to Mac OS Syria. Now you have successfully installed the Mac OS Syria. Uh, you might be getting some problem like audio. But I have fixed it. Okay, uh, your graphics might be 4 MB or 8 MB or 16 MB, something like that. But I have installed the graphics driver and I will show you how to install the graphic drivers and all this stuff in another video. It's 7 o'clock. Mm. You're so quick. Uh, you might be getting a graphic glitch while going the order, like zigzag coming something like that okay i have installed edorance battery mm, okay so many stuff so i will talk these things in another video so thanks for watching please like subscribe and